Hello and welcome to Hitting Tree Simulator 2016. Can we hit the jump? Can we do the fly? And we're gonna roll it for God's sake. Let's try that again, you fat GTR. Why is it rolling again? I wasn't even turning. There you go. Ten, ten foot. <laughs> Take the angle better, pants. Here we go. Why is it doing it again? Stop rolling. You fat turd. I think we've done it. I think we've done it. I think we've done it. No, we're going to hit something. We landed it. That's it. We did it. That should be two stars at least. If that's not two stars at least, we're going to have to do another thing. Two stars. That should mean we have enough fans to expand the festival. Are you joking me? Are you taking 77 fans? Are you taking the piece? Welcome to Forza Horizon 3. We are so fucking close to the next showcase event, which is the final one. I think. I'm not... I can't, I can't confirm that because I'm not too sure. We need one more event. I've just been doing, like, these speed cameras and stuff. PR stunts, if you will. Because they're kind of easy to do. I don't even need to do very well on this one, but hey. We're going to give it a bit of a roar up anyway. We're going to try and... <laughs> oh, I thought I was going to mess up then. And I'm so glad we jumped up... No! We landed on the building. It's all right, though. I've never seen this area before. <laughs> I literally never. This is like the perfect drift location for off-roading vehicles. But hey, I've never seen it before. Look, literally, you can slide up logs. <laughs> never seen it before in my life. Anyway, that sort of fucking slowly going up the fans like I didn't get that many fans. Are you joking? We finally got. Hey, this the, the, this should be the final one. This. It's a I fucking blimp. The for the final showcase. The biggest, stupidest, craziest idea I had. I thought, not a chance. They said do it. So we're doing it. Get down here right now. Your biggest, craziest idea is me racing a fucking blimp. Fucking budget on this game, I tell you. It was absolutely nothing. Like, honestly, I don't know how you can go from jet fighters, from fucking, I don't even, like, speedboats to a blimp. Like, oh, yeah, let's race a bl- This is it, boss. Our what? Big finale. The big finale. The big finale is this shitty little Look dirt cart thing, thing and a fucking blimp. Have fun, yeah? Size doesn't matter all the time. Unless you mean that, then, then that does kind of matter. I'm sorry. Like, I'm sorry to say, but it kind of does, unfortunately. But that's just the way it is. But look at it. Like, we're racing like, we're racing a bl- Okay. We're racing a blimp. Look at the size of it. It's not even that big. It's a small blimp. I've never seen a blimp in real life, honestly. I've never actually seen a blimp in real life. I've not, like, you see them in GTA all the time. See, load of them. Load of them. Ne never seen one in my life. Never. Don't think I'll ever see one. It's a fuck. It's a blimp. And I mean, what I'm driving is not that exciting. <laughs> it's not that much more exciting either. I'm driving this little bloody thing. Like, you, last race, we drove we jet fighters in a Lamborghini. As much as that like, Lamborghini bores the shit out of anyone that sees it in anything now. But it was it was jets, all right? We did speedboats, for example. We raced a train. That's pretty awesome. That's Top Gear style. And now <laughs> we're racing a... I'm sorry, I keep going on about it, but it's such, it's such a downgrade. Like, they should have ended on the jets. The blimp should have been one of the first things you race. No, it's like... They literally probably just sat there like, shit, we should probably extend the game a little bit because people can complete it in like a day. What can we do? A blimp! A fucking blimp! You sucked! It's not a bad idea, actually. I can't think of anything else. Oh, here comes the jump. The epic jump. <laughs> That's the, the least exciting. I don't like, someone could be massively excited about this. I don't know. In the comments, let me know. Are you, are you hyped about this? Are you... Are you, like, begging for more Horizon after seeing the race against the blimp? Why has it got a wheel bigger than my fucking cart thing? I don't know. Why is the screen shake like I'm going a million miles an hour? Because there's a blimp near me. Is the blimp even that big? No. It's like I'm about to battle fucking Robotnik in his latest creation that he made for 50p. It's a blimp. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think the coolest thing about this is actually that we're on a crazy off-road section here That's going up and down. It stopped. It's flattened out a little bit, but it was up and down and crazy and all over the place Yeah, I've got to cut up some slack. It must have been difficult to come up with an idea for the final showcase event uh, Like I don't I don't know anyone that would find a blimp more exciting than racing jet fighters in a Lamborghini Like there's only so much you can do Uh but, I mean, there, there must have been something different that could have done. Like a pretend UFO that's being controlled by a hydrojet. 
like so underneath the hydrogen. It's just UFO. That would be a bit silly. Then we'll be going to St. Trotto. Don't do that. That was a stupid idea. How about racing kangaroos? Australia. I don't know where I'm going. The road, I completely lost where the road was there for a second. But there's the finish. I think the blimp's gonna win. It's ahead of me. I, the blimp's, the blimp's gonna cross the line. No, it's slowed down. Across the line. I don't know what to say, honestly. That's the sound of 50,000 fans having their minds blown. 50,000? Is that it? I swear we had millions. So, so we had like 5 million now. That's 10 million. That's that's why we had the blimp. That, that. There you go, friends. The end. Where's my guy gone? He's gone! He's fucked off. Oh, he's got out. He's got. He's just showing off. Showing that he's a smooth magee. Are we going to get 100k to finish it off? Or are we going to get a Horizon Edition? We're going to get an Aston Martin. Don't mind if I do. It's weird that they don't double the prizes when you get those anymore. But he is happy with himself. We've got 12 million fans now, which means we've got a festival expansion and the fans keep going. Good. I was ter I thought that was going to be it for the fans. I was scared because if it ended there, I'd be like, boy, just let the fans keep going and going and going. Don't you do levels. Except that goes to the 999 then I think it stops. But there we go. You did it. The yeah, I did. Horizon festival in history. Horizon oh, thank you. Australia isn't going anywhere. There are more races and The mouth move is like PS2! More fans to bring down under. Fucking so, who comes on a coach? What should we do next? What should we do next? Um Do snow in Australia! There's the credits rolling in. Let's have a look. Ralph Fulton, Gavin i I've never heard of him. You should promote him a little bit more. Technical Alan Roberts, Benjamin. I I don't wanna I don't wanna care. I don't I don't care about I don't, I get rid of the, who watches the credits anymore they need, like literally there's there's two types of people okay there's the people that finish the game and skip the credits and the people that sit through the credits hoping that there's going to get a trophy or uh, <laughs> achievement well as going through the credits at the end of the credits because there were some games that did that or you'd get like a special unlock for waiting through the credits do you remember those games it might have been mostly ps2 yes but I still do it sometimes. If it's like GTA, I, I wait through all the credits because it had something cool happening. Not just going around one of the most unappreciated cars ever because it is just, it's it's unappreciated for a fucking reason. Oh, we're doing another expansion. Oh, how to end the game. We're doing another fucking expansion. So that is fully upgraded. I think level five is the maximum. I ain't too sure. We've got level three, level three, and a level four. I may as well finish that bad boy over there. She wants some attention. But one thing we've got to do in the let's play before we finish, you finish. We've still got to do street two sets of street races or two sets like leagues of street races, which basically give us the Lamborghini and the RX-7. So definitely going to do those. Those are like, do you mind calling? Try to record here. Expand that festival, boy. Expand that festival. We need it. We need that festival level five. We need all of the level five. That's how you can fully complete the game. Like, it's the point in where I've beat the game, but it's just going to do a little bit. But I really want to get the RX-7. Like, that's, that's something at the top of my list. I wanted to get that straight away, but I didn't. And obviously, when we level up the festival, we get some unlocks, I think. Yes, we get some, some cheaper cars, should I say. And they're all wank, so I'll I'll get rid of those. Come on, these events aren't going to run themselves. We've got to get 1.34 million fans to basically level up the festival again, the next festival, which honestly, I don't really care about doing. I'm not gonna do that. Like the let's play from now on is literally, only thing on the top of my mind that I can think of right now is the two cars that I haven't unlocked yet that actually anyone gives a damn about. For the festival expansions, like if you guys wanna see that, let me know down in the comments. If you if you don't really give a shite like me, then let me know. Cause I, I, don't, I don't think anyone really wants to see me go through all these events. Cause let's, let's face it, Let's have some real talk at the moment. I don't think there was a lot new in this game. Um, I know they added body kits, but that's pretty much all I can think. Like the 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 whole creating events thing wasn't really fleshed out as it could be. Like setting your own routes is how people would assume that would be the case, but you couldn't do that. It's an interesting one. I I enjoyed the game. Don't get me wrong. If you've not played Forza Horizon Two, then go for it. Go for it. It's a perfect game. But if you've got if you haven't picked up this game yet, I'd say hold off for a little while. Wait till it drops in price. Wait till you get it for Christmas. It has some exciting content at the beginning, but as you progress, it kind of feels a bit more samey. And I would say that's seeable in 
my views and people's video views and also the fact that the content that people are creating as well. It's pretty similar because there isn't a whole bunch new. But I'm not to say this is a bad game. I'm excited to see what happens when it comes to the snow DLC and that kind of thing. But um, yeah, let me know your thoughts on Forza Horizon 3 if you've beat the game or if you haven't or if you haven't picked the game up, you're just watching videos, whatever. Let me know down in the comments. Uh, this was probably a shorter episode of Let's Play, but again... It's pretty much completing the last event. So be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you are new. And my friends, next episode, we're going to be getting a motherfucking good ass cop. And we're going to be pimping it. Pants style. Peace.